so this is a big problem, <clears throat> not just in charity organizations, but in politics also, because it's political season or whatever. And so you see a lot of these politicians talking about all these plans they have and all these ideas they have and desires they have to change things, but they never go into the specifics. They never tell you how they're going to change any of these issues that they talk about with so much passion. And I think largely it's because they don't really, their intent really isn't to do so. I could be wrong, but that's how it feels to me. Um, and then also when you like these organizations, so right here, I'm trying to just figure out where the $400 million is going to. And I'm also seriously curious about, you know, working for these people. If, <clears throat> if, um, there is an opportunity, which if you're a charity organization, you know, you should be open to volunteers coming to help you out. And I would love to volunteer for a cause that's actually willing to help people. I'd even do it for free just to see, um, you know, how things go. Um, however, I do think that, you know, part of the change that's happening or needs to happen, in my opinion, with humanity is us, you know, performing jobs that are actually good for ourselves in the world, as opposed to jobs that are actually exploitating the earth and other human beings. And one of the ways that we can start to do that and really be about that change and be that change is by doing jobs that need to be done and that are good, like growing food and giving it to sick people or impoverished people. And, um, you know, <clears throat> if there's already people who are willing to donate $400 million to a charity organization, then clearly the will and the desire um, for human humans to help other humans out is there. Um, but again, you know, the devil is going to do what he can to corrupt um, in any way that he can. So anytime there's big money, there's going to be big temptation, which is why I think transparency needs to be an absolute essential of any type of charity movement um, just to keep us all in check, man. And um, so, but anyway, with that $400 million in revenue coming, they could easily, uh, you know, spend, like I said, $20 million or even more to, you know, paying people like myself and others to just help grow food and to start building hemp factories, start building houses that are hemp, uh, built out of hemp and eco-friendly. I mean, there's just so many things that you can do alone with just the hemp plant, you know, and then mix that in with an actual, you know, <clears throat> system of working that's, you know, nurtured in love and, and nothing else, you know, and have that be our guiding force, which is why the Bible is, um, you know, the reference I use spiritually um, to help me get over my demons. And if we implement more of what, Jesus is really talking about in the Bible into an actual working strategy, um, then the better off we all are. You know, and this is also something that bothers me about, you know, other Christians is because, you know, I see that, you know, they, they praise Jesus. They, they spend so much time praising Jesus and, and this and that, you know, but it's like a lot of what Jesus was, was about action. Like love is an action. Like, you know, take care of the sick, take care of the needy, like do good, expose evil. Like it's about doing stuff, not just praising him, but actual doing stuff. And I guess I'm frustrated because I don't see very many Christians who are actually doing things. Now, there are some, but there's not many. If there's 200 million Christians in America, there's no real good reason why we shouldn't have like an army or an organization where I could just go and just go into and start helping them out. You know, there shouldn't be need all this bullshit and all this legalities and all these things that get in the way are really from the devil. Um, so, you know, but again, if you were just to click on this, you know, to try to find out, like, how can I help, <clears throat> you know, I mean, it's just, it's, I'm pretty sure it's going to take me just to a donation page. Okay, well, let's see, what, let's, let's see what they have to say up here. Okay, so, we're watched... 77, uh, let's see, so they're talking about how bad everything is. So donate, so you can donate to them. So they need sleeping bags, blankets, psychological support, you know. Um, now they're talking about Poland, they're having issues too. But the thing about it is, is I wanna know specifically to what my money is going to. Like, what exactly my donation is going to? Like, what type of products are they using? Are they using good products? Are they using bad products? Like, how much are the people who are working in these organizations getting paid? Like, how much of the resources are actually going to the people? Like, what are the inter dynamics of how this situation works? And that's just not what I'm seeing here. And that bothers me. 
And then I, it's, it's, there's a lot of people, you know, talk about just how bad things are. And I think that these organizations also use that, you know, bad press as a way to motivate people and pull on their heartstrings to get them to donate. And um, again, you know, I mean, it's a good thing to do if, if the cause is really good. And if the cause is really good, then you shouldn't be sharing your, your cause and everything about your cause because that would be just more good energy your way because you're perpetuating more goodness. So the fact that they're not showing the specifics of what they're doing with their money and how they're specifically helping these people leads me to question some things. Um, I mean, it's just not specifics. Like, I want the numbers. I want the statistics. I want, you know, the, 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 the gritty details of what's going on. You know, $400 million is a lot of money. This is obviously a big organization, and it just seems to be a very vague statement, and yet they're asking and getting a lot of money. So, anyway, um... You know, and then it's like if you click on their first slogan right here, it just takes you straight to this, you know, and it's just a straight donation page. There's not any information about anything. It's all just donate. And then it's like 36 a month, 60 a month, 108 per month, 190 a month, 500 a month. Like, and then down here it says all gifts up to $1.5 million will be matched by generous donors until 12 p.m. on November 3rd, 30th, 2020, which is an awesome thing that they're, they're really going to match people who are donating for a good cause. Um, and I hope it is. Again, I really do. But when I'm not seeing the specifics of where this money is going and the, and the specifics and the intricacies of how they use this money, it gets me worried. So anyway, um, I just want to share this with you guys. All right. Y'all take care. Bye.